hi and welcome back to ask nk in today's video we're going to be looking at how we can create our own custom material inside twinmotion 2019 so we have uh, an interior scene here and inside here we have this chamfer box now what we would want to do is to create a custom material for this chamfer box i will go over i will select the eyedropper tool or the material picker if I select it here I'll click on this grid and click on the plus sign to create a new material so within this new material is where we can add all of the textures that we want to assign to our new material so what I'm going to do is I'm going to click on this come over to color and click on more go over to texture and say open and I'll go through and select the texture which I want to use so here we have a clay brick I'm going to select the clay brick and now it's not visible because we've not assigned this material the new material which we just created to the chamfered box so I'm just going to go ahead and click drag and drop right on top of it and if we look at this material now it's looking nice and a bit flat so what we're going to do is we'll need to add a bump to it unfortunately we don't have a bump for our material but we have a normal map which is going to serve as well so what I'm going to do is I'll go over to the settings here I'll go to the bump click on more select texture click on open and add the normal map I'll also go back because it's not visible and I'll increase the bump height a little bit now you see as I begin to increase the bump height you start noticing that the chamfered box is having a bump texture assigned to it. Other textures which we can add is the metallic texture which we don't have any texture for that now. We can also add a reflective texture to this so I'm going to go over to more, go to texture, click on open and I'll find a roughness texture which we can use for the reflection and we can go ahead and punch this off and our material begins to reflect light if we go ahead and select and press F to focus on it we can hold down shift and with the middle mouse button we can rotate around the material so now we've created this material the problem or the question is how do we save this material just in case we want to close to in motion open it again and make use of this material for further projects so how we're going to do that is, I can come here, I can click on this material, right click and click on rename, and I'm going to name it brick. After naming it brick, I can click on the material, right click and add to user library. Now if I add this to user library, Twinmotion is going to save a copy of this material inside the user library so that anytime I turn off Twinmotion and turn it back on, I can easily come over to the user library and access the brick material here so this is how you can create materials in twin motion 2019 if you have questions or comment about this video please put them in the comment section below if you like this video please give it a thumbs up and share it with your friends and if you've not subscribed to this channel please subscribe and turn on notifications so that you get updates next time we're uploading a new video peace